to better understand diamond dressing, it's important to know the processes involved. Let's take a look at the next few slides. A metallic centered diamond wheel consists of multiple layers of diamonds. In order for the wheel to work properly, the diamonds must be exposed. As you can see, the picture on the left shows before the dressing process, as the picture on the right shows after the dressing process is complete. It is necessary to use the appropriate dressing stick to remove the bond and expose the new diamonds. As you can see in this illustration, a rough diamond consists of large diamond particles while the concentration is rather low, as compared to a fine diamond when the concentration is much higher and diamond particle size is smaller. To ensure success, make sure that the diamond wheel and dressing stick are closely matched in grit. During the dressing process, make sure that water is being used to keep the diamond wheels cool. To avoid damaging the wheel, make sure to oscillate the dressing stick during this process. The first visual indication will be a color change. The color change is to represent a new layer of bond that's been reached. The objective is to tear away the bond at an even rate and create a nice smooth surface while exposing new diamonds. Some wheels, depending on their condition, may require the use of two different grit dressing sticks. In this case, the process would remain the same, consisting of one rough pass and one final pass. During the dressing process, make sure that the CNC machine is set to 2000 RPMs. This will allow for the appropriate work to be performed.